All right, so the little sprite is in which key? Uh, this is in... <laughs> so Where's the feet at? D minor. D minor, absolutely good. And uh, you have lots of D octaves, right, in your left hand. Let me hear you play this line in your left hand, because there's so many jumps. to jump with your one and three so that you can get better faster instead of using your one five because it's such a further way to go. Can you use your three there? Yes. Good. Nice. Good. Is that a little better? I'm not sure. I think it's because you haven't used that all week. <laughs> so it's better to not try to jump so much with your third finger because you're going to have a wrong note somewhere in there. Right? So you can always practice it with the least amount of moving, that's the better for you. Yes, one, three, one, four. Yes, good. And then let's see. Let me hear you play this chord in your right hand. Beautiful. Good. And this one. Good. And what finger goes on those with that chord? Yes. And why do you think that fingering it works better? <laughs> so quickly in that line. Good for you. So it wasn't that, wasn't that traumatic, was it, at all? Good. All right, so what is your number one goal for this piece? What would you like to have happen next with it? This part. <laughs> okay, that part you that really part are overall. not comfortable with. It. Okay, so first of all, we got to get the rhythm right. So you have it marked in your score. One and two. And one and two. So let's make that into one impulse right there. One and then where does your pedal come in on? Does it come in on the left hand or the right hand? The right hand. Okay, yeah, so listen for that. Okay, don't go on. Just don't go on. No, 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 because we got to get the rhythm right. Mm -hmm. So can we do that three times in a row? One and two and. Good. One. So now you'll go to the next downbeat, okay? One, two, and one. Good. Just right on that downbeat. One, and one, two, and one. Good. Four times. One, two, and one. Good. Beautiful. That's 
two. One. Okay, so now you just have to keep the same rhythm. Okay. One, two, and one, two, and one. There you go. Now that makes more sense, doesn't it? Oh my gosh. Now, if that is your rhythm for right now, one E and two and one E and two and one and two and one. Okay, good. So why don't we go ahead and take it from here. One and two and one. So, in order for you to feel really good, and that's just the wah ba ba the eighth note, okay? Mm -hmm. So, in order for you to get the whole piece faster, which part do you still need to work on first? That, mm -hmm. right? Because that was the most challenging, mm -hmm. right? Rhythmically, mm -hmm. right? So, then inch that one up, right? So, instead of 126, why don't we say something like 144, okay? Mm -hmm. And work on that at 144, and then do the whole piece at 144 mm -hmm. and see how it feels. Does that sound good? Uh, we'll just need yeah. to change. Yeah, the eighth note. The yeah. quarter note to the eighth note. <laughs> or else it'll be so lickety split fast. <laughs> 